European Rural Innovation Contest, the EURIC, was launched in January 2019. We wanted to find and award excellent examples of partnership for innovation. We were looking for farmers, foresters and agri-food initiatives with a story to share. These initiatives, these group, these powerful cooperations can inspire other ones as well, either in the near environment or abroad in other countries. This is the basic idea of our approach. We want to show what is out there, what is often overlooked. Rural innovation is currently one of the hottest topics of discussion from farmhouse kitchen tables to the EU Commission offices in Brussels. All across Europe, farming, forestry and agri-food initiatives are facing major social, economic and environmental challenges, as well as unprecedented opportunities. We want to make a contribution to finding and establishing solutions for the significant challenges farmers, foresters and we as a society are facing. Innovations are urgently needed and those innovations that are at hand need to spread more quickly within the area and across borders. We know that the exchange of knowledge and of practical experiences enhances innovation significantly. We also know that innovation solutions will be even more successful when people come together from different backgrounds, from different disciplines or from different professions. Lessons learned from the past show that coming together for joint problem solving and the co-creation of new ideas is much more successful and faster than when individuals, firms or research institutes set out to develop innovation by themselves. Our EU-funded liaison project aims to make a contribution to fostering cooperation and co-creation and help to improve the dynamics in these mixed groups of innovators with a special focus on farmers, foresters and associated rural businesses. It is not easy to organize and to manage joint efforts for innovation. For that reason, European and national research and innovation programs aim to enhance such types of joint innovation in land use industries. With our European Rural Innovation Contest, the EURIC, we set out to discover examples of cooperation and co-creation from all rural areas of Europe. The EURIC especially aimed to seek out innovative, inspiring and groundbreaking initiatives that were not so well known or visible. We were looking for excellent examples of innovation in products, processes or services in the agri-food or forestry sectors that we could learn from. But what they all have in common, they were able to realise their ideas because they worked together. We have found small and big groups, groups with researcher, teachers or advisors, with entrepreneurs from processing or retail businesses, or with persons engaged in nature conservation. Sometimes consumers are involved as well. However, Farmers and foresters are always in the centre of the innovation group. We identified and selected groups because of their achievements and experiences in organising the mixed team of people successfully. These achievements are often overlooked because they are so difficult to see from the outside. We aim to recognise them and acknowledge their achievements as a group. We call them Rural Innovation Ambassadors because they stand for a large but unknown number of cooperating innovators throughout Europe. When you talk to them, you hear from new energies and fresh ideas and encouragement that grew with the joint effort. They tell you that the emerging solution or innovative business model is much more than the sum of the individual contributions from each partner. Their journey often started with the crazy idea and then they encountered peaks and valleys, but in the end, they reached great milestones. We did the same when we visited them. We departed on an exciting journey from east to west, from north to south, and to the center of Europe. Our journey to meet and film the Rural Innovation Ambassadors was a bit like the endeavor of the innovation groups. Terrific outlooks, great people to meet, but long ways between. And it does not end because there is so much more inspiring collaboration for innovation out there.